Get ready with me today as I head into the office. This is a very simple makeup and a really good one to use if you are working in the office all day. So I'm starting out with the Hydrolux Water Cream by Youngblood to really nourish my face and give it some hydration. Then I'm going to go in with the Eye Impact Cream and just wake up the eyes and massage that all the way around. And as you notice, I pop a little bit on my lips as well. It is really, really nourishing. I'm going in with the Liquid Foundation. This is also by Youngblood. And I'm using one of the Tenille Jai Foundation Brushes and just buffing that into the skin. You will notice this little red dot on my nose that I have not quite got rid of. It's from my sunglasses. That it was missing one of the nose pieces, so it's dug in. Anyway, we'll hopefully cover that. For the contour today, I'm using the Emco Beauty Contour Wand, and I'm just really shaping my face and pressing that in using the same foundation brush, just giving my face a little bit of warmth and creating some shape as well and lift. I've got my hair already done. It is looking a little bit fluffy, so hopefully some of those curls will drop just a little bit before I go in. Now I'm just preparing the base. This is just a really light powder all over the base of my eyelid, all the way up from my top, underneath my brow, right up to my lash line. And I'm going in with a really soft sort of tan brown. This is from the Fernando Hervas, the Nude Collective Palette. You can find this on my link. Uh, the link is under Silk Oil of Morocco. It's a beautiful palette. It's got some gorgeous earthy shades. And I'm just sort of buffing that in and creating some shape. And I'm using the shimmer, it's like a champagne shimmer, and I'm just placing that all over the ball of my eye and right into that inner corner. This creates just a little bit of lift and really brings those eyes out and brings them forward. This keeps it simple as well. Now a slightly darker shade, I'm placing it right into that outer corner just to create a little bit more drama there and a bit more definition. I feel this really helps to um, make my eyes look that much bigger. Using my favorite eyeliner pencil by Youngblood, this is chestnut. It's a really nice creamy chocolate color and it really works into the lash line quite well. Once again, to helping to define those eyes. Using the Mineral Mascara and I'm just running that through my lashes. Once again, just to separate the lashes, create a little bit of volume and lift. So very, very simple. This is quite a quick makeup and an easy one to get you out of the door. This is the Emco Beauty Brow Set and Fix and I'm just using the set side. The St. Renee's Lip and Cheek Tint in Castiglione. I like this shade because it's really natural, earthy tone, and it just works so well. I'm setting the makeup with the Rice Setting Powder by Youngblood, and I'm trying to sort of get rid of that little red dot on my nose. I may have to go in later and do a little bit more concealer. And I will spray this down with some setting spray from Home Beauty. Let me know what you think of this simple look for work.